Here we go, three five-minute rounds scheduled. La Rosa with the white tank top, Berezikova in the black. Oh, La Rosa lands a high kick. Look at Yulia with a one, two, three, lightning fast combination. Yulia is looking for a headlock uh, takeover here. Oh boy, and the throw, La Rosa down on bottom. That flurry of punches was no surprise. Yulia saying she's very frustrated having trouble finding MMA fights in Russia, so taking boxing matches to stay competitive. Oh, look at La Rosa here. She could be sweeping around for this armbar. One of the great attributes of Barazakova is her speed. Look out. She's got the arm isolated. All she's got to do is extend that arm, and it's serious trouble for Barazakova. And now La Rosa throwing the punches. She gives up the arm to throw the punches. Oh, look at the strength of the Russian fighter. And she battles her way from below. Trying to grab the legs of La Rosa. Look at that, she's, she's got a hold of the arm. Rezikova doing the right thing by throwing her legs over the body and stepping around. La Rosa trying to get the choke. This is how she finished up Amanda Buckner, and Rezikova better get herself out of there quick. She's got a full body triangle on her. There's no way Rezikova's going in. She knows enough about the sport to know that La Rosa is doing enough damage to keep the fight going. Reza Kobe did a great job. She certainly knew what she was doing when they got to the ground. And if she manages to hang on like this, I imagine the fight will get stood up soon unless Perez Kobe finds a way to get busy. Guys, gonna have to improve your position. We had a lot of conflicting stories about what. Uh... Reza Kobe had a clear shot at LaRosa's face, pounded away at it for just a bit. And now Tara trying to get in position for a submission. And once again, we see move. Kept... Now. Not a lot more she can do from that position, but still, Tara going for the armbar in the one oh, second. Oh, nope. Clock ran out. Rezikova in the black top against USA's Tara La Rosa. Oh, and now the punches start to fly, but La Rosa says, let's get it to the ground. And look at this. Nice, beautiful double leg takedown. Look at Rezikova. Right with her. One thing about Perez Kova, when she finds herself in a bad position on the ground, she never stays there. She never lets herself get held down voluntarily. She's always trying to be perpetual motion and squirm out of the bad positions. La Rosa stepped over seemingly with, with no effort at all and gets full mount position. If she was more in the center of the ring, I'd say, hey, go for that arm bar that's wrapped around your head. But in, in tight towards the ropes, don't do it. And now La Rosa feels away the arm. Here we go, the there arm is bar. the armbar. That arm's extended. That is looking bad. Perez Akoba oh, rolls look at this. this. Oh, she's down. No, she does tap. And almost, that is it. Almost managing to step over the body and get away from the armbar, but at the very last second. United States Army combat instructor, Terror.